Good day friends, welcome back to this series on summer growing pastures. My name is Fritz von Otsure. Today we're going to look at the extremely popular smutsfinger grass or Digitaria eriantha. Smutsfinger grass is a rather tall and leafy grass growing up to about 1.6 meters high. The inflorescence is a semi-digitate inflorescence consisting of many long thin racemes. Smutsfinger grass is a perennial tufted grass and comes in two ecotypes, one with stolons and one without stolons. Smutsfinger has grown in most subtropical to warm temperate regions of the world. It grows best in a rainfall range of 550 to about 1300 millimeters per annum. It is not tolerant to frost or excessive heat. It is, however, more tolerant to frost than white buffalo grass or panica maximum, but less so than weeping love grass or aerogrostis curvula. This map shows the suitable areas for smutsfinger in South Africa, with the greener areas highly suitable and the pinkish or orangey areas more marginal. Although this grass is adapted to a wide range of soil types, it prefers well-drained sandy to loam soils. It is not tolerant to waterlock conditions. Smutsfinger grass is used for direct grazing. It makes a high quality hay and is extremely popular as a foggage during the dry season. This grass is a high producer and can produce 8 to 20 tons of dry matter per hectare, depending on conditions for growth. It's also a high quality grass that produces crude protein levels in the order of 9 to 20%. The digestibility of its fodder ranges from 45 to 70%. Thanks for watching the short introduction to Smutsfinger Grass. For more information, feel free to contact me. You can get my contact details on our website, which is at www.workingongrass.co.za. Cheers for now.